So in, in trending news, Telegram is now announcing that it's going to have its own crypto exchange and wallets. So this is kind of a shock and a surprise considering the fact that the FTX uh, bankruptcy has caused a huge crash in the crypto market, yet companies are still willing to invest and put money forth into these systems. It's just like we've been telling you, this is just a way of transitioning for regulation. They're not getting rid of crypto, they're not getting rid of Bitcoin, they just wanted more control. They also needed a fall guy to point all this lost money onto that they had printed and caused inflation. They're trying to deflate the currency, get rid of all this excess cash that's flowing around and use this bankruptcy as a way of doing so. So now billions of dollars have now been removed from the economy, right? So what, what does that mean? That means that there's less dollars that each price of an individual dollar goes up. And then we all feel the crunch, every individual person, but they blame it on some person that they propped up. We don't know where their money came from. Speaking of Sam Bankman free, right? But the main point of Telegram is that they're trying to like get in before Elon does with what he's doing with Twitter. They're like, no, we're gonna be a social media messaging platform that allows you to exchange cryptocurrencies. Well, you know, Elon already kind of said he was wanting to do that. Now they're co-opting. Now a little bit of information on Telegram is there. Uh, they were founded by a, a Russian individual and everybody thought that he was going to kowtow to the Russian government, but he's not consistently. And he's, it's still a very popular um, social media messaging app that's used in Russia and Ukraine. And he's made a stand on um, platform security and privacy. So we'll see how that goes out. Um, obviously, crypto is not dead and it's still going. But remember, there's a mark that's coming that it says in the scriptures in Revelation that no man could buy or sell save that he had the mark. And that mark is the mark of man, right? The number 666. Only those that are sealed by the mark of God, right, are protected from the coming perse uh, well, uh, persecution, tribulation. They will be persecuted, but they're protected from the tribulation. So we want you to remember these things as you're paying attention to the news, these tech articles, these tech uh, blogs and stuff talking about crypto being dead. It's not. It's still here and it's coming, coming right back around. So stay in the words, stay strong. Thank you and have a blessed day.